let's look at question 31 the width of a block of wood with rectangular cross section is x centimeter the height is two thirds its width and the length is four times its height what is the volume all right let's see what this is all about it's a block of wood let's see this is the block of wood now the width is x so it is x wide its height is two thirds its width that means two third x right and the length is four times its height this means four times four times the height four times two third x all right so it's four times the height remember the height is two third x so it's four times two third x so remember the width is x it is x y this is the width the height is two third its width two third x the length is four times the height four times two third x what's the volume in centimeter cube all right so the volume would be the width x times the height two third x times the length which is four times two third x four two is eight so it's eight thirds x then now we can see there are three x's once it says volume you can this you can just ignore a and d because you're going to have an x squared there's x in the width the height and the length so it's going to be cube in, you're going to end up with x cube i mean x here the width times an x in the height times an x in the the length so it's between b and c that you'll have to decide now the three x's x times x times x that gives you x cube times the numbers 3 over 2 times 8 over 3 3 cancels 3 2 into 2 1 2 into 4 2 oh hold on it's 2 third times 8 over 3 which will give you 2 8 16 over 9 right so let me do it properly over here the x is multiplied to give x cubed by 2 third by 8 over 3 up top you have 16 down bottom 3 3 is 9 so you have 16 x cube over 9 so that's b that would be the answer for question 31 31 is what I have to scroll to see 31 31 is B all right now let's look at 32 let's erase this this rough work and look at 32 Question 32 says the mean of 10 numbers is 58. If one of the numbers is 40, what is the mean of the other 9? Hmm, let's see. You have 10 numbers. You have N. Alright, so these two num 10 numbers A plus B plus C plus D plus E plus F. You get the idea. 
one two three four five six seven G H I J so you have ten numbers the mean is 58 so you add them when you add them up you get 58 now let's say they are the same numbers you can assume that they are the same numbers so if you get n times 10 it gives you 58 now you remove one of the numbers one oh one of the numbers is 40 okay now what happens here is that when you have all 10 numbers and you divide by you add them up and divide by 10 you get 58 all right you add them up and divide by 10 you get 58 what if you did not divide by 10 what would you have got what did you get before you divide by 10 it is 580 you see that now take 40 from it you remove 40 what do you get 540 what's the mean of the other numbers there are nine numbers left now if there are nine numbers left it means that when you add up all the nine numbers you get 540 now you add up all nine numbers and get 540 so it's nine and whatever they are it's 540 now what it's the mean of the other nine nine numbers you want so you divide by nine right you add them up and divide by the number of them nine into nine goes one nine times what gives you 54 six and you add the zero here so 32 b so 32 question 32 b right so 32 is B. Uh, 33. Let's erase these rough work and look at question 33. The observation which occurs most up frequently in a sample is the we look we looked at this a short while ago. It's the mode. So 33 question 33 D. So that's the mode, all right? Uh, where we are now, 34, 34. Now in this case, what we're going to have to do is to zoom out so we can see all of it. All right, question. What is the area of the shaded region here? Let's look at what you're supposed to do. Alright, I can see two triangles here. I see uh, I see a smaller triangle and I see what's this girl doing all the way out here I see a larger triangle alright drawing is a bit messed up let me try that again so I see this triangle Let me pause a bit and come back. Yes, so we have that small triangle 
and the other triangle I'm seeing here is this triangle all right so you have those two triangles let's just erase them and deal with them separately all right you have the smaller triangle at four high this is this this is the four I'm talking about all right so it is this four right here you have zero and this goes out to six and you have the bigger triangle I'm fighting for space here this is five it goes up to five you have zero and the same six now it's just a matter of finding the area of both triangles and subtracting them to get this area so the area here is half base times height half of six times four what is half of six three three four is twelve right and the area here would be half base times height half of six times five three five fifteen so we have a twelve and a fifteen when you subtract them fifteen minus twelve we get three so that would represent this area so thirty four Seem like it would be D for the answer question. I can't see this very well. Let me erase this part. 34 is D. All right. Question 34, that's D. And then we're going to look at question 35. Let's delete these rough work and go on to question 35. In the diagram B, that's B here, is due north of A, which is this. Going straight up, that's north. Alright, you see the north symbol and the north line here. C is east of B. So C is east of B. A, B is equal to BC. You can see it from the two strokes at each end, at each line. What is the bearing of A from C? The bearing of A from C. All right. When you say from C, it means C is where you're going to draw a north line and the bearings are measured from north in a clockwise direction. So this is the angle you want to find, all right? Now, let's see what happens here. Since these two are the, sa are the same width, then this is 45 and this is 45. But that implies that this is 45. Now, from here going here, that's 180, it's a straight line. And then continuing, it is 180 plus 45. What is 180 plus 45? 5105, 5, 8 and 4, 12, bring down the 2, carry 1, 1 and 1, 2, 225, D. So question 35, D. Alright? That's question 35 there. We pause at this point and we continue next time.